All now right. let's talk about some there will be lawyer <laughs> efforts here. Shohei Otani, no big deal. Four and a half million dollars disappears here. We have multiple story changes. Rick, what is the latest on Shohei Otani and Major League Baseball with their quote unquote investigation? Uh, he changed his story late last night. You didn't hear it. Now he said he Uh-oh. never signed with the Dodgers. He's going to go back to Tokyo, ah. and uh, and he never bet. He didn't even know how to bet. <laughs> no. See, here, here's, the, here's the problem with all of this. Nobody knows. I will say nobody knows. And the storyline is, as we know, the interpreter is not going to talk to the Dodgers because he's been fired. He has no obligation to do it. The investigation, Major League Baseball, will maybe get to the bottom of it. But the FBI and the Securities and Exchange Commission and all of the federal organizations that arguably have jurisdiction are now going to find out in the old Nixon terms how much he knew and when he knew it. And the bottom line is nobody knows now. And anybody that speculates right now is just doing a disservice because we know two things. One, because of the zero tolerance policy, if it's decided that there is any indirect or direct gambling on Otani's hands, Manfred's got one of the biggest decisions in his career about what to do about it. And then second is a lot of lawyering, which is good for me.